right, folks, we're going to 923 A1 truck. Uh, do it an air dryer um, upgrade. This is the Wabco. Uh, Give it a lot of the MRAP. It's going to be sold on surplus right now. Uh, you got three ports on it. You got a uh, inlet, which is this meter side. Your driver's side will be your, uh, your tank. This right here is a secondary uh, tank valve where you can it all in. Uh, this is the half inch pipe fitting. Half inch pipe fitting. And this is your inlet for your compressor. So we bought one, 24, and I think 21 right here uh, on these little valves. There's your governor. Powerful blow off. Um, as far as the bolts go, 90 bolts are M12 by 1.75 by 35 millimeter. So that'll get you 20 enough to do the plate. And uh, it might actually been raised up um, with the Pierce dryer. This thing weighs 22 pounds less than the Pierce dryer. So, um, Pretty, pretty cool actually, um, but all right. Well, you hear it blow up again one more time. If I turn it off, I'm actually gonna turn the governor up on it some. Um, as far as your other governor, you can actually uh, just actually block it off up on the firewall. You can take the uh, the uh, port off and um, just block it off, or you can come here and cut it, put a line on it, block it off there. And leave it in place in case your governor fails. You got a secondary one. So what we'll blow off here again in a second. Um, about 135 psi. We're gonna turn it up to right now. So you hear it building off pretty good. It's The tank did build up a lot faster on air. I'm pretty sure it'd be a lot faster if I went in and put a plug and put a uh, fitting out of that little fitting right here and uh, let it air up off of that. So I didn't do it yet. Uh, so it's gonna blow off again. May have turned it up too much. There it goes. That's it. Pretty simple install, about 15 minutes. Uh, it's a pretty cheap dryer. Uh, normal spin-off goes through on top, they're about 30 bucks. So, pretty good mod.